what's up guys we're back with another video uh, I wanted to show a little bit more of the beetle I'm wanting to take these things off what do you guys think I crunk it up uh, I, if I don't take them off I need to get one more of those but I really don't like the style of those and plus I need to fix some things on the inside as you can tell there and in the back there is green carpet instead of black which up here has some black and uh, I don't know. What do you guys think? Should I redo the carpet and do the green fix, or what do you think? And also, I gotta get some more new things of these because these things are just not good anymore. Probably from all the sun that's been beating on it over the time. The reason the light is on is because that is not plugged up. The oil pressure is not plugged up because it is missing in the back. I'll show you the back in a minute. Also, the dash is missing the cover piece. But uh, what do you guys think? I know the other video was kind of short, uh, just showing off the beetle, but as you can tell, I still need to replace the carpet there. I need the carpet for there. The carpet is here on this side. I believe I may have the carpet down here. Like, just random pieces of carpet is everywhere. Um, I gotta figure out what is what and what do I need. But other than that, it's mostly pretty nice. As you can tell, the doors is fixed. Uh, little pieces peeling off here. I may be able to glue that back. I need to glue that back. They kind of like slit this open. I don't know what this hole is for, but it is cut open. Could have been a like, uh, what is it called? A brace going inside the car. I'm having no idea, honestly. Uh, this car was built before with like a bigger motor. And uh, I bought it with no motor and put a motor inside and got it running. So now we're kind of doing that. Um, also, let me know what you guys think. This wire was hanging. Uh, it goes to the back of the motor, but I have no idea what it's for. Um, but yeah, we do have speakers. Let me show you the outside. I do have the hood for it, but I don't have it on right now. But as you can tell, we got the motor running good. She is running pretty good. Old school motor. I do have the piece to go across. And, uh, the pin job is okay. But as you can tell, the light is also messed up. But yeah, guys, let me know what you want to see. Uh, what should I do to this bug? Should I redo it? Should I just fix what is needed and sell it? You guys let me know. Um, there's the back seat. As you can tell, I don't, I'm not a fan of the green carpet. And that looks kind of like rigged up or needs to be glued back. So we're going to fix all that. Um, that's how I bought it. I really didn't look at it too much when I bought it. I didn't see the green carpet and stuff. It was kind of like a get it now or miss it type of thing. There was too many people on it, so I didn't get to see everything I wanted to see. But uh, yeah, it'll work. If any of you guys have any of these things for sale or have, I've seen a lot of people do the 3D print that uh, replaces these with caps. If you guys have the file, please let me know. I have a 3D printer and I'd love to print it and not have to buy it, but uh, yeah. Over there's the hood that goes on the back. And I also have the bracket. Let me see. Somewhere. Oh, I have the spring right there. It runs perfectly good. As you can see, it's running right now. Um, it does have the aftermarket radio upgraded. My other one, if you guys want to see that, let me know. But my other one is fully restored to old school, like how it would have been in the 68. Because if you don't know, this is a 1968, as you can tell by the thumbnail. But uh, yeah, guys, we're going to have fun restoring this one back to how it was. Not really how it was. This I want this one more of an updated, as you can tell by the headlights in the front. It is kind of more new school. But still a beautiful car, and I just want to have it back on the road. So you guys let me know. And if you have anything that I could use or parts, let me know. I wouldn't mind uh, buying from you guys. It'd be better you know to buy from you guys than ebay or something like that uh you might get a better deal and sell some stuff you don't need but yeah guys that's pretty much it and until next time peace and stay tuned for more volkswagen updates